M and Ten New Business One Town Manager's Contract. Mr. Welch, Taxpayers uh, Board. Uh, Frederick W. Welch, Town Manager's Evaluation for 2014 is the basis for the Town Manager renewal of the contract. Uh, there was unanimous uh, consent and a unanimous vote. Uh, the table or the uh, document that was uh, uh, approved, produced, and with considerable effort by Wanda Robertson uh, the week prior to her passing. Um, the, the document consists of a Board of Selectmen written evaluation, a Board of Selectmen numeric evaluation, a Board of Selectmen immediate assigned objectives for the town manager, Town manager's, uh, town manager's accomplishments. Uh, number five is an enclosure is New Hampshire RSA 37 colon six, which is the powers and duties in particular for a town manager. Number six is the employment agreement that was offered and accepted for the years 2015 through 2018. There is a signature page and the town manager's employee response. And if I may, the immediate assigned objectives by the Board of Selectmen, some of those were discussed tonight. Uh, the State of New Hampshire relationship, uh, the economic cost of the Town of Hampton for services provided to the State of New Hampshire, the joint operation plan timeliness and effectiveness, money issue for the reimbursement of our considerable efforts down there on state property, an increased awareness and appreciation for of the state for the town contributions and just exactly what we do and, and this this will kind of bring it to the fore and give our chief executive the authority uh, from the board of selectmen from the people of the town of hampton and we've just looked at the audit and some of our challenges to to uh recoup and have a better relationship with the state on that um and then um another uh objective is uh, to lead the legislative uh governor's council and this board uh, in an effort to advance the Hampton interest. And we talked about that uh, a little bit with our legislative effort. Um, infrastructure CIP, uh, one, identification of immediate infrastructure needs, the costs, and the tax impact. So that is an immediate assigned objective. And then a close supervision by Mr. Welch and prioritization of the CIP effort. It was signed by Mr. Welch, the Hampton Town Manager, on the 18th of August town manager's accomplishments the employment agreement agreement effective as of 8 18 2014 by and between the town of hampton a municipal corporation of the state of new hampshire with a principal business at 100 winnicott road hampton new hampshire and frederick welch of 191 walton road seabrook new hampshire hereafter called manager or employee recitals one general on june 30th 2015 the above name Frederick W. Welch shall continue in the employment of the Town of Hampton as manager, having commenced in that position on March 12, 2007, pursuant to the provisions of RSA Chapter 37, and having all powers and duties set forth therein. His employment has been continuous and unbroken since two, March, 2000, March 12, 2007, and this employment agreement is intended to continue that employment with the same benefits until June 30, 2018. He can, continues to be considered an exempt 40 hour per week employee. Number three, salary. Subject to the terms and conditions of this agreement and while engaged in performing this specified du his specified duties for the town, the manager shall be paid an annual salary as follows. $108,000 gross payable in weekly installments of $2,076.92 gross each week for the year June 30th 2015 through June 30th, 2016. In such sum, as the Town of Hampton Board of Selectmen shall vote to pay ma the manager following his performance evaluation at the end of that initial 12 month period, as set out in paragraph 7 below for the years 2017 and 2018. A town manager's wage increase tax impact statement would look like this. His current salary of $96,809 is 0 .035 cents per thousand on the tax base. His increase of salary of $11,191 is 0 .004 cents per thousand. The new salary from June 2015 next year would be 0 .039 cents per thousand total for our town manager. 
Again, that was with a unanimous vote of the entire Board of Select Performance Evaluation. The Board of Selectmen shall review and evaluate the performance of the manager every 12 months. The manager shall be eligible and subject to Chapter 3 compensation of the Town of Hampton personnel policy as amended, except that the manager shall not be considered an employee at will, may be removed to discipline only for just cause, in the terms of the Town's personnel policy in effect of January 1, 2004. Mr. Welch again has accepted the offer. He has had a response to this offer, and it is part of the official document. Thank you very much, Mr. Welch. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, sir. New business.